YouTube, what is good? We are starting off the week on a great note. As you can see, we have all these orders, crazy array of good, bad, great, different Yeezys, Crocs, Dunks, Jordans. I guess we'll start off up here because I do want to talk about at least a few of these orders in here. We got some Crocs that just came in. Got a couple Yeezys, a used, pretty smoked UNC4 next to a very clean white metallic purple 4. Those brand new go for so much money, it's crazy. These are a beat pair of Bordeaux 6s. We started these at 99 cents. They finished about 50 bucks. We got some used Yeezys, brand new white Oreos. I talk about this sneaker a lot because we honestly kind of never really sell them brand new other than like two, three times. So I'm glad we got to sell this pair. We got a brand new infrared six. Note the uh, Jordan Air on the back. That means these are from 2014, I believe. As you can see, they got a little yellowing, but they're still brand new. I call these a Rasta Man Solomons. I know that's not what they're called, but to me, that's exactly what they should be called. Definitely a Rasta vibe there and a very cool sneaker. I don't even know where you can even find these. Speaking of that, got some turf football sneakers got some 270 safaris we got a size 15 3m5 that sold for 30 bucks plus shipping something like that we got a smoked smoke pair of union fours that we bought on saturday that already sold and it's funny because i said they'll sell in 24 hours and they literally did brand new dusty olive size 7 we have a kobe i believe these are called opening nights or something like that and i got these in a flea market made a little bit of money on those we got a para very clean condition on these like new we got a brand new raging bull next to a used raging bull we got the sweet buttery new jordan twos brand new pair of gatorade sixes we got a brand new pair of hair sevens from the cdp pack that's something you don't see often speaking of don't see often the brand new valentine's days I mean, we can go on and on there's all types of crazy stuff going on here today guys i mean let's talk about these real quick though we got a brand new 2022 pair of big bangs and we got the og big bang can you catch the color difference obviously this one's used so the bottoms are all messed up but pretty cool stuff going on nice to see the used pair go out and nice to see a new pair go out these sold for 160 ship that's uh, probably like what 50 60 bucks under retail we got a lightning we got a brand new pine green three and then we got some jerseys here i'm not gonna lie i lost a bit of bread thinking that tom brady and the bucks had a chance last night so i don't really like seeing that warren sap jersey at the moment we got a work done falcons we got the amari stoudemire phoenix suns we got the nasty boy shirt vanderbilt medicine shirt 49ers crew neck north face jacket that i honestly didn't want to take in but i did for some store credit it's already gone and that's about all i'm going to talk about when it comes to the orders anything for the people a lot of good orders. I want to start off here with the Chicago's. No, they're not the Chicago's, but two's fire. Then we go up to the Olympic sevens, even better. Then you go to the Bacon's, or the Air Bacon's, excuse me. Five, fire. The Barry Sanders, clean. On the Solomon's, again, to wear a sneaker. Not, not going to see many stores with this type of shoe, but that is a pretty rare sneaker. Market's all over the place on those. The Valentine's Day Air Forces. We have a couple of white Oreo fours, but ready-made blazer that we've probably had for like three years now. Happy to see that one go. We got a big roll of LeBron's. We got like five LeBron's going out. So really happy about that. We got some diamond. We got some paras. We got some Kobe uh, tents. Slade Crocs fire. I think those are soft 350s. Those are clean too. The 2014 infrared sixes. It's just a lot of stuff, honestly. It's kind of overwhelming looking at it. But again, shout out to everyone who purchased something. Can't forget the Chicago twos because to me that's probably one of the best shoes in here. I, I, actually, I lied because you got air bacon's and stuff like that. It can't be the best shoe in here. But I probably go air bacon best shoe and a lot of cool jerseys. It's a cool little batch. Two big bang selling. A couple mids. I I'd say the best shoe here for me is probably maybe like a guava something like that i love this real lebron's right here you got a, like a lot of classes and then you got a re-retro right there i love seeing both twos go out the chicago's and i think those are the varsity reds i'd say my favorites out of this bunch either the solomon's or the bacon's two really good sneakers one of them a classic one of them a newer model so shout out to everyone who bought on the ebay this weekend i guess i'll talk about my favorite real quick i think the cdp pack sevens are just crazy the quality on that stuff back then is just way better than the stuff they put out now kind of sad sometimes when you come across a sneaker like that and uh, you see the newer ones it just kind of sucks but anyways let's just make sure to get all this stuff packed up shipped out and see what happens today
You don't have a price in mind? I ain't coming here with a price in mind, to be honest. Uh, keep a buck with you. Uh, I'll probably be like 550 for everything. You just sick? Uh, need you in the middle, 575. Right. That's cool. Uh, what's my, my map is like where your map is at. So I'm <laughs> what's the best way for you? I'm probably just with Zell. Either with whatever you want to do. All right, let's see if Zell works. What's the phone number? Alrighty, guys, what's going on? I feel like it's been a while since we've done a recap, but um, we got seven sneakers. So shout out to that dude who came by and dropped some stuff off to us. This is how we're starting the Tuesday. So we're gonna start off right here. Got some SBs in a size 12, with challenge reds. Pretty clean. Uppers are really clean. Suede's pretty clean. It needs a little wipe down, but overall, the sneaker's pretty clean. It has that clear bottom. So not really a fan of shoes with clear bottoms because I feel like it gets dirty real easily. And a lot of times, stuff just looks really dirty with the clear bottom. Probably gonna be a 99 cent auction beater. Aaron nines. I remember when this shoe dropped the ones. Everyone wanted the nines, and then you needed the thing. What's the baseball team? The Alabama Barons or Birmingham Bar Birmingham Barons baseball jerseys to go with it and stuff like that. And no one really wanted the ones. And I remember myself getting the ones, and that was my first pair of ones, and I really liked them. I actually trashed them and played ball in them, so that was a really good sneaker. But this is more than likely going to be a 99 cent auction because again, it's really beat. But again, it is a new cool sneaker. Another sneaker I had when I was in high school, a sneaker that I really love, Johnny Kilroy with the number four in the back. Really clean sneaker. I think I tried traded someone for these but on the inside of the tongue it says Kilroy kicks butt again size 12 really really clean just need a little wipe down here but overall this sneaker is just really clean really like this sneaker it's gonna look really good on the shelf this sneaker I've never seen before these are the Jordan 1 SBs they're called like the Clyde something I don't know something weird but never seen these before they're a little crazy a little cool these need to wipe down but again this is just something different not a sneaker that we get every day so these are pretty cool you also have some infrared 10s Again, size 12, really clean. Everything here is a size 12, except for the ones. Don't need to go too much in depth about this sneaker. You guys definitely seen this shoe a million times. I'm not really gonna talk about that one. Here, we have another good pair of shoes that always sells pretty well for us. The alternate 89 fours, just a white and red sneaker. Again, it's just a clean colorway. Not too much to say about it, but yeah, it's really clean. All stars, again, need a wipe down. Got all this stuff for 575, so really happy about that. It was originally at 550, he asked for six, man in the middle. So that's a great way to start the day. Day. It's already two o'clock, so we got about like five more hours of the day. So let's see what people bring to the store. Good afternoon. Um, brought these back just in case to see if maybe we can kind of meet somewhere on them. Okay. Um, there's One ones. Um, it's just these five, four? Five, five, yeah. Five, yeah. Okay. Let's see what everything's used, right? Yeah, everything's used. Yeah. What were you looking for? For everything like um, each. This uh, one I'm kind of interested to see where at. Okay. So that one is a tougher one to move. Uh-huh. Um, but I'm gonna see where you're at on that yeah. one. Um and then these are the two. If you look at these, oh yeah, yeah look at those. Um, I kind of see where you're at. I mean, I got, I kind of got a price, but I kind of always want to see. Yeah, where you're at. Even if you're high, I just want to know where you're at, so I kind of have an idea what I'm looking. This is the one I really want to know. Uh huh. Like I know market has dropped on a lot of stuff lately. Yeah, I know, I know, brand new. I believe when I when I looked, I want to say I think brand new is a G, but we're not talking brand new. And then I know you still yeah. got to make your money. So um, because when I got rid of my pair. Um, because I had a nine and a half when uh -huh. I got rid of my pair, market was down. Yeah, so I think it's up now because when I got them, they were six. It's really because I got them at brand new at six. So you probably had them for a while. Then. 50, yeah. yeah. I think, yeah, I think it might even be something in here. How long I had them? Like last sale was nine on go. These three should be pretty easy to find a price. Yeah. That one is probably gonna be like we so might be off on that one. Probably figure out on this. Yeah, again, I don't know where you're at on it. Um, um, I gotta see it again. I gotta see like what the used market is looking like, but that one we might be off a little bit. Where I feel like I want to be on these may sound low, mm -hmm. but I'm just judging like pairs on goat that's like mm -hmm. really similar. Um, you want to price like individually? Um, what would you spit out just a whole price for everything? Um, let me see. Yeah, we kind of we kind of start there and then we'll 
break it up from there. I gotta check this one, but this one still might be holding its weight. Mm -hmm. But like a lot of these shoes that like came out before the dip are like the shoes to gauge a price because like when I bought my pair, I kind of pay high. Like I pay like seven, like almost yeah, eight. I think I got, I think I got them at like eight. Yeah. And I, now. Think that now, I think it's rare because the guavas was more than these at one point, and now the rolls have reversed. For this stuff, I was around like 12. Mm. I was around like 12 for this stuff. All right, so let me see where we are at. Because I was kind of thinking at least 1450. Okay. Uh, 1500 if it was maybe a stretch. But if you're at 12, let's see where we can kind of. Where are you at for the pines? Sense. I was kind of thinking like 500. Um, okay, I was thinking on these. Like, what are these? Um, they're like 450, I think, of yeah. something like four. So one, one. I was kind of thinking maybe like 350, but we could probably. Go, we can kind of negotiate some of these numbers. So uh -huh. if we have 500 and then maybe 350 on that, so that's 850. These I was thinking like, I'm gonna skip to here, maybe like 250 on that. Well, I, this, this. Oh, you didn't pack these in January? Nah, nah, nah. Okay, cool. So, we so, can, so you was at like 14 with those? Yeah, yeah. So, oh, you did, so, oh, you was just on these right here? Yeah. Oh, okay, so, so let me see. Let me do the, let me do the numbers real quick. So that might So you was at 14 sense. with those? Yeah, let me let me add it up. I'll say like I would probably be at that with okay. those. I would those because I know we talked about it last time. That's yeah, why yeah, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I kind of put that to okay, the side cool. for so, now. Like, so that's why I was like, hold on, okay. So let yeah. me see. Let no, me, no, 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 no. So let's see. I was, was at. It's yeah, gonna balance out like however you do it because yeah. you said you was at fourteen plus for this stuff. Where were you at here for this one? Um, I was at like five. Oh, so I was at like five and five on these. Three fifty on those. So if you go five, thirteen fifty. Yeah. And then these, I know this is kind of like probably one of those things that I don't even know where you're at on these. I was kind of like open on because I know the price went. It sucks because I got these for fucking early for four hundred. Yeah. And the price, the market went down on those. We weren't too far off, mm -hmm. but like I was less. So probably not too much at five. So on like them. I was like um. I was in at five. I was at like 425, 425, 3, um, 75. See, um, I knew this one would be like a, one of those things where I'm like, ah, you know what, for that price, I might as well keep these shits. Yeah, it's just like, those, like those, those things like really, really yeah, bad. Yeah, and, and I like them. That's the thing. Like, nah, it's a good shoe. They just, yeah. they just take, what, what, what fucked it up was that I, I think a lot of people hit on it and they canceled it and then they re dropped yeah. it again. Uh -huh. that, that's yeah, what messed it up. Market. And a lot of people got their pairs late too. Yeah. So that was the problem with that sneaker so. because they were going for like like six, then mm -hmm. they cut in half. Yeah, because I think now they're below their 175 brand. They're under retail. They're under so, retail. But if I do get rid of them, I'll probably do like 100 on those. Uh, so US 75, so it's kind of like. Um, because I would do the 14 with those. Shit, I'm like, what's up? Why should you jump all the way? Now you said 5'5, yeah, yeah, yeah. 350, that's 13, 13, 15, 15, yeah. 14, 15. I was at 2, which is 1650, but you was originally the other day. I think you was at 275, yeah, and you came down to 250. 250, yeah. So that's that's where you were at. Like I said, I'll run the 14 for the 5. Did you do 15 for everything? Because I'm at 14, right? 1425. Yeah. So it's kind of like. Maybe like an extra 25 here, an extra 25 there, 450, 450, maybe 25 there, and maybe use like two here, so maybe another 25. So it's kind of like adding 25 to everything, I'm guessing, if that makes sense. 25, 25, 25, 25. So if I'm at, if I'm at, uh, 15 even. I think you have it's, like, it's like 25, 25, 25, 25, and 25, basically. Yeah. Because that's 75 right there. Yeah. This would be 75, which would make it the 15. Yeah, 14 for everything. I was at 1425. Oh, you was at 1425. Yeah, because I, okay. I, I said, I said, um, I said around 14, um, but when I broke it down though, it was something 50. It was like, um, I think it was like 11, right. I think 11, 50. And I said, this was 75. Okay. And then that's 1250 right there. And then uh, you said, can we do 15? Uh, and then, I'm trying to think. So yeah, 75. If I see you, just keep these. Like, mm, right. uh, brand new? So, you're willing to do 15? 15 for everything. I'll do 15 for everything. Because it's what, just adding 25 somewhere. Like, like, yeah, yeah, it'll be yeah, like $75, yeah, yeah. basically. Yeah, so 75 If we can do 15 even, that uh, works for me. Fuck it. Another bio today, second bio. Again, today's Tuesday. It's not really going to be a crazy day. Tuesdays is always those days where we just tidy up from the weekend. Get back to the grind, basically. Just want to organize everything, stuff like that. Ooh, I've never seen those before. Oh, that's taillights. I'm fried. They just look so different from <laughs> over here. <laughs> 
disregard that. But <laughs> disregard that. But yeah, like I said, Tuesday's is not really a crazy day for us. So it's just a slow day. So a lot of times we like to get a lot of work done. I know Berwin does a lot of editing and stuff like that on Tuesdays. He's literally doing that right now. We got in some really good pairs right here. We got five pairs of sneakers. As you guys can tell by the boxes, that's probably like my favorite part about looking at all these sneakers right now. The different boxes, every box is unique and different. And that's like one of my favorite part about sneakers. Let's just start off here. And by the way, everything here is a size 10. If you guys want like these fours or one of these fours, I would say hit us up ASAP because they're going to go by pretty fast in my opinion. Starting off here, we have the Travis Scott 6 British Khaki. Not much to say about this sneaker. It's really clean. Great shoe for season right now. Comes with the little string backpack. We got some Union 2s. Again, this is a really cool sneaker. I know prices are really down on them. This is a really clean and nice sneaker and just considering that market is like really low on these, I might consider, you know, going after this pair. Burn, will, will you still buy these? If your pair came in, would you buy these? If your size came in, would you buy these? Nah, you wouldn't? I think I would get these if they came in my size. I kind of do like them, especially them being that low. I could find a used pair for like 120, maybe 150. I'm a cop them. They come. Yeah, the twos. I'm on four. Lightly, lightly, lightly used. Like this is what you call VVV. VNDS. Really clean. Shoe is trash though. A little crease right there, but still clean. I wish they would have gave us extra laces with this pair, like a black or a cream. I think that would have been cool. If you would have asked me probably a year ago, probably would have been like the two best shoes in my collection or my two favorite shoes, Off White Pines. The quality on the sneaker is just really, really good. The leather is really nice. It's really soft. This is one of the best Off White shoes to be made. It's the second best Off White Dunk in my opinion. I think Lot 50s are better. These are top two for sure though when it comes to Dunks. Another the beautiful sneaker, the Union 4 Off Noir. That's hey. definitely gonna be gone by the weekend. This one is definitely gonna be gone because if we sold that beat guava, that beat guava that fast, I think we're gonna sell this one pretty fast. And everyone's always asking and calling for an Off Noir. And I feel like just last week someone asked for a size 10 or 10 and a half Off Noir. Got the extra laces for you guys. The tongue is already unstitched. That's about that. We can fill these slat walls up now. One, two, three, four, five spots, six spots. The only ones that matter are the upper. So all these shoes we just got are gonna go up there how much you want for the jerseys uh we could do so we could work on those how much you want for the shoes uh we're like 750. Yeah, you'll pass on these and said these are all fake the jerseys all right. Sorry. <laughs> they're fake because they're all authentic I guess. Like they don't make fake jerseys with stitches. Yeah, so like, just like <laughs> they, they actually do. I know. I, I've seen them. Yeah, so um, like I'm looking at them. The... What size is this thing? Not smaller. Nah. It's not 11 and a half. Who's it? <laughs> That's cool, bro. That's one of those. Nah, I look small, dude. 11 and a half. Wow. You need that. Yeah, What's this hitting for, bro? <sighs> I'm pretty sure it's sold online on eBay, but the person never paid. Let me see. Uh, they sold for 18. It says waiting for payment. Okay. You didn't have those already? No, uh, I have Union ones. I got, I got Travis's and I got uh, off -ways. Luxury leather, bro. Huh? It's a luxury leather. <laughs> it's the better leather. You're trying to sell me. You didn't give us one of these already? I, I get those shits all the time, bro. Like someone else get them. Why did someone else? What you asking for everything? I don't know. Let's see. Uh, I like uh, these two I probably wouldn't want, to be honest. Which ones? The two new balances. Just the new balance. It's not hitting like that anymore. Uh -huh. um, these two I would definitely take. Okay, so what are we looking here? Uh, let me see what the tree lines are at. Right. No tag on this. Tree lines mm -hmm. are like mm -hmm. under retail. It faded out. It's or at like retail. Old I want to be low. So the, so the bulls jacket are you at? Said a hundred. They're, they're, they're going for Yeah, yeah, I know. The so what are we about for both of them? Um, I think they sold like for 270. Yeah, 270. I'm surprised for that size. And then what? When you take the thing, how much is it? Uh, 270. 240? 250? 215. I would do 330 for both. 
for both, so this I took one, a, the three one three one three one three one pretty rare. Take like a $50 so off straight to the floor. I didn't even know that. Yeah, that yeah. Got a hat. Got a little poster. 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 Thank you, bro. This is a thrift, bro. It's a flea market. He, he doesn't wear nothing but the good the shit. Top gun jacket. It's a, yeah, it's, <laughs> it's, a, it's shot leather, bro. It's good, bro. He, he, don't, he don't wear nothing but the good stuff. <laughs> I, yo, that day I was there, I bought, I bought a shirling and this. Nice black, old black on black shirling. You know what shirling is with the hoods and shit? Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice one, bro. I happen to be both my size. You know what I'm saying? Like, in the dead of winter and the cold and shit. They're like, perfect. Look what I had in two. Five bucks. Five, ten, and twenty extra. Twenty dollars altogether. I got a whole bunch. The hats are not moving right now. Yeah. So let's get nice hats. They look good. Yeah, they look good on the wall. Look even better. It was going to someone else. You can't do anything with the Amish, bro. Bro, the five fifties don't move. Crazy. It's such a. Now look at these. Look at these. Um, like gum bottoms. I never seen those before. Cool. One twenty. He said on this stuff he'll pass. Oh come on. And stuff like that. Posh marks even. Like, Dude, a how much did yeah. you shoot? Too? Appreciate that, man. Yeah, no problem. Sure, bro. You don't want this for, for yourself? Oh, you're not a Jordan fan, right? Oh, that's a dope. It's a nice little pick, bro. Ask him. He, he, had big, he had big bulls fan. Here, yeah, five bucks, bro. <laughs> it's a nice little stone. I'm, I'm good. No, he's not. Bro <laughs> wants it. He's very good. I'm good, man. All right, so send it to me. What's the number? Guys, in case you're wondering, Mercury is out of retrograde tomorrow. So shit has been out of whack for, for you for the past uh, two weeks plus. The beginning of January, you're not the only one. Wrapping it up here, anything for the people? Finally got the slat wall fixed. Situated? Yeah. Off-White Pines, Union 4s, I'm a Manier, Union 2s, British Khakis, we just put a Rookie of the Year, these two dunks, and the case looks good too. Yep, a lot of stuff going on, that's for sure. Shout out to everyone who pulled up today, appreciate it. We definitely bought a lot of stuff, sold a couple things, so that's always awesome. Anything for the people, Evan? Just let it in three days. <laughs> should, we, should we tell the people where Evan sent me this morning? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's not get into that. Don't bring YouTube in. Don't bring YouTube in. Real quick, one and done. See you guys tomorrow. YouTube, what is good? We are here. It is Wednesday. We have a decent batch of orders right here. We're going to start off with the Vimeros. We got a 12 and a half Georgetown. We got the Soleil Sasquatch Croc. Shouts to Vance on that order. We greatly appreciate it. We got the Miami Hurricane Dunk, which uh, I think is actually a very nice colorway. That orange really pops with the green. I think in the summertime, these are going to hit. Here we have a 99 cent auction. That was a white mid. We started at 99 cents and it finished about $40 ship. We got some Fragment 3s. Probably said it once or twice. Those definitely grew on me a bit i really didn't like them at first now i think they're you know decent decent shoe here we got the uh what do you guys call starfish. those starfish <laughs> one women's at uh jordan evan and berwin like i personally am not a fan of these but uh to each their own we took these in at 50 dollars in trade credit all black jordan one they're extremely smoked put them at 99 cents i honestly thought they'd finish at about 100 dollars. they finished at like 65 so you know it is what it is we'll wash our hands there and uh roll it into something else speaking about rolling it into something else we got this is the first victor cruz ever made Don't don't quote me, this might have been. No, 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 no. I think the blue one was. The blue, yeah. No, no, no. I don't think the blue one was. Damn, I might have to get deep in my bag on this one. It wasn't the gray. I think it was this. Don't quote me, guys. I think this. it was this. I'm just going to talk about how, you know, I went to UMass from Jersey. Victor Cruz, you know, from Jersey, went to UMass. I believe he was undrafted. Don't yes. quote. Undrafted, did his thing. I thought that, you know, collecting the whole collection of these would really do numbers, but they definitely don't. That pair, brand new, years, years later. What size is it? Size 8, brand new, from 2015. $120 ship. What was retail? 140 120 does it say? Still says it. 150. Again, Nike. Should have gave Top Shelf a shoe because they wouldn't be selling like for that. Just kidding, just kidding. It is cool to see him get a sneaker, but again, I, I, I've probably spoke about this once or twice. I don't remember many uh, athletes that get a sneaker like that and then just kind of disappear off the face of the earth and then their sneakers just like disappear and don't go for any money. Can we think of one? I mean, who's got Nike? Saquon's got a Nike lately. I mean, technically. Odell. Odell, good one. But he won a Super Bowl. Yeah, he did. It. He did. He did. Yeah, he which was is like crazy. A, he was like but he MVP. almost disappeared off the face of the earth and then all of a sudden he won a Super Bowl. Brandon Jennings, Under Armour. Uh, that's not Nike, but you're right. He got a shoe. He disappeared. I'm talking about a Nike guy. Who like gets his own shoe, gets his own line, and then all of a sudden it's just gone. PG. 
Whoa. Nah, PG's still going strong. <laughs> yeah, no like, whoa. <laughs> whoa. A lot of people hate PG too. A lot of, a lot of people slander him too. So. They do slander PG. But he's still he's still going. I mean, look, moral of the story is it's very hard to get a Nike shoe. It's also very hard to stay relevant in sports, culture, entertainment, whatever it is. So shouts to Victor Cruz. He's still doing his thing. We're still uh, selling his shoes, thankfully. Here we got Baby Shower 9060, which Burn will probably speak more about. And we got the Pistachio Union Dunk, as well as a hoodie going out to Nikki. Shouts to Nikki. And then we got a Dub Zero. Whew. These things are beautiful. Not sure how wearable they are, but they sold for seven. $75 shipped. Just brings back a lot of memories just looking at a sneaker like this. Everything about it is really awesome. We got some Kith pants. We got the Toronto Raptor pants, Nike vintage joints. And then we got the Jaguar jacket. That might be a sign. Shout out to Trevor Lawrence because I, I I know we haven't talked much about football, but I just have to say, if you throw four interceptions in the first half and then just come out the second half a dog, like that's crazy. And you got to respect it. So like that just like motivated me in life in general to seeing somebody do that because you got to be down bad going into the locker room to come out and do what he did that was like that was just incredible to see so tip the cap hats off to him anything about the orders guys it's a weird looking batch but to me it's a really good looking batch i'm gonna start off with the romero's the romero's just really beautiful that ash gray it's just like a really nice comfortable sneaker that jerk sound six you guys seen the video already you guys know like that's one of my grs of 2022 slay crocs that's in a couple hours top 10 so really like that shoe really comfortable really really a nice design something fresh for the brand croc the miami hurricane dunks favorite college team so really like those the orange is a little bright on them, just a little surprising. You got two mids, black and white on opposite ends, both dog. Fragment three, pretty dog. That starfish is really nice. It's a nice sneaker. You go down to that wheat Victor Cruz trainer. Like that's an ugly colorway. I'm not gonna lie. It looks like a Tim. Shout out to Nikki for copping two sneakers, the pistachio, the hoodie, and the 9060 baby shower. Again, I'm not really a fan of that 9060, even though I did see someone wear the, the regular gray pair at the mall. They look high. Right. They look high. Right. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm still not gonna do it. And the dub zero is like A said. Like, that's a sneaker like everyone's going crazy for retro nowadays but you know people used to go crazy for dub zeros and i know i personally had a pair that shoe was just really cool just seeing all like the laser jordans on on one shoe multiple j's like combined it was just like really fire then you got a couple pants a duval jacket so shout out to t-law because you got that dog shout out to the person who bought those dub zeros because i've been looking at those in the warehouse a lot lately so shout out to i think his name's alex a couple other good shoes are the vimeros and those cro the black crocs i kind of want a pair of those shout out to the person who bought that jacket Jacket. It's actually pretty cool. Yeah, shout out to the person who bought the 96 is Definitely one of my favorite models from 2022. The cookie colorway is way better than this one, but that one is pretty cool with the colors. I love the starfish, the orange, and the brown on that. It gives me like Cleveland Brown vibes. This Jordan 1 is giving me Black Air Force activity vibes, but if you bought that, you know, shout out to you, man. And the Vomeros are making a comeback this year, so can't wait to see what different colors Vomeros come out. All right, guys, uh, I've been working really hard on videos. I'm going to see this later, but uh, we're trying to stay as consistent as possible and get kind of caught up on content we will be at got soul on the 28th of january not sure when you're seeing this but if you can grab a ticket pull up bring some inventory we're going to be buying all day i'm really trying to buy as many pairs as possible try to find some good deals steals all that stuff so it should be a really good event it is at the meadowlands so you know in our backyard sadly we're gonna have to close the store but i think it'll be fun because uh, saturdays in here have been great but they have been very crazy you know it'll be nice to go to a show it's been a while it's been probably like what a year now i'm very excited for it should be awesome and hopefully we'll be able to go to more shows in the future let's Let's pack up all this stuff and see what happens today. Look at the cell train. I just want to look Carter. All right. Did you see anything that you wanted? Yeah, I was looking at the. Uh, damn, this still look bigger in person. <laughs> oh, appreciate it. Where are you from? I'm from Harlem, bro. Oh, oh shit. Well, appreciate it, man. I was looking at the um these the your birds. Mm -hmm. I got these two birds. So different box for each one. Okay. Fire red and. Oh, and these, I don't, I don't care, you can do whatever for me. Alright, what are you asking for your stuff? I know because they're used in this red box. I, think, uh, I mean, I just want to store credit, bro. So. Yeah, what, what are you trying to get? I wanted the... Uh, it may not be out here, we may ha have it like a couple of doors down. The, fit, the, <laughs> the 15s, oh. I think they were used. The navy? Yeah. I think they might be back there. And the, um, the bread lows. What size with the bread loaves? I think 11 and a half. Uh, those? Oh, those? Yeah. Is this the one right here? Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, I was asking four on these, right? Yeah. yeah this is the, um, the 15s. And then, Berwin, can you grab the 15s as well, too, please? Uh, 11. I don't know if they have box. And this is the bread loaves. And then, these are the... 
city clothes. I mean, up city clothes. No, I take clothes. You can work, right? Like, you know. Yeah, I can work. Let me see what we have them up at. We got these at two twenty-five, right? Yeah. Did you do one ninety on these? So like, I was at like, I'll drop those to two, and I'll drop those to three seventy-five. Which would be five seventy five. If it was cash, like just like paying straight cash, I would be able to do the one ninety for those. But it being a trade and the condition, some of the stuff, I'll probably be at like three seventy five and um, two there, which is five seventy five. Let me see where I'll be at here. Did All you, right, so let's start with the uh, fire res. Where, where would you be at for fire res? Did you have a price in mind for those? Yeah, I'm trying to see, bro, because they kind of high. You do one seventy. I'm not too far off. What you that? And they clean. This is a little creepy. I was at 150 for those. You do 160? Let's see where you're at with the other stuff. Carmine's where you're at. These I was kind of low on. You do 100? I think they're going to sell for 100. I would probably be at like 40, 50 for them. Because even even with box and stuff like that, they don't really sell like that. So like, yeah, I'd probably be like 40 for them. What about the, um, the bread? This one I didn't look up yet. You said what? This one I didn't look up yet. What are you asking for these? Yeah. You do like 190? Like judging by these conditions, I'll probably be at like 125 for these. So that's 315 and we have one. Right, oh, bread. I could be at 375 for everything and then add two on top. That's probably where I'd be at. Excuse me. Well, everything, all of them? Yeah. And it's like a flat too. How much you put these up? I was buying those like around like 40. They're just pretty cut. Nah, I, I respect it. I respect it. Like, you hoop it in these shoes, bro. I'm going to keep it buck with you. Like, this is probably like a 99 cent auction <laughs> for us. Um, but. And yeah. for the car mines, what you said you was at? I was around like 40 for them just because, like, no box. They're going to sell for like around like. Like the hundred is probably we're gonna try to get the hundred for it with box. They usually sell for like 130, 140. Can the 60. Um, I probably want to be at the 40 for the car. Price. Probably gotta be at the 40. I gotta be at the 40 for the car. 45. So. <laughs> right, I gotta be at, <laughs> car, cause I was less than 375, but I called it 375 to call to make it a flat two. Like I was a little bit less, like I was around like 350. And you, um, that's cash or that's credit? I was around like 350 cash, 375, that's why I called it, so it make it like a flat two. So we had like one flat number. Again, try those two, one, two, just to make sure like, it feel good and everything. I know 15 sometimes runs small. Um, These are 11, right? That's an 11, you can try them on though. The leather on the Mystic is like really, really soft. Mm. That one's a little stiffer and that one feels like an actual Jordan 1. Mm. The other one feels way too new. Mm. Like that's different, like that leather, you're not, you're not getting that like, in, t in 2023. Yeah. That's a good pair to have. That was, a, that was an outlet sneaker. And how do you like to pay the difference? Oh, cash. Okay. Five bet. And if you ever see anything else online, yeah. we ship too. Like, mm -hmm. So like, you can hit us up on the DMs. Um, same thing, like you make an offer. Mm -hmm. um, you take like that Moselle, um, Apple Pay, so we can ship it to you. You'll get it like, since you being in Harlem, you'll probably get it within like a day, two max. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, bro, some stickers. Yeah, am I on camera? Yeah. All of them in a building. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might be the first person from Harlem to pull up. We always get like Bronx, we get Queens. <clears throat> you might be the first person to Harlem to pull up. You really the home of the white Air Force. Mm. You sure about that? Uh, they took all this Bronx now. Nah. <laughs> I, I heard St. Louis. I, I, I mean, St. Louis? That's what Nelly said. I'm, I'm hearing a lot of Harlem or the Bronx. I prefer Harlem, cause one, you got Dapper Dan, you got, and of course you got Dipset. Uh, <laughs> like, you know, Harlem, Harlem's, Harlem's where it's at, really. You know, a lot of Harlem's where it's at. Like, that's like the problem. That's why the demand is so high, and it's an all-black sneaker. So, mm. that's 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 really why, um, it's like that. But they're not gonna probably drop for like, I don't think so, like for a good minute now. That's probably why they're so high there. Uh, what are you looking for these two? For the gamers, I'm looking for at least three and some chains if you can do that. 
three some change I probably won't be able to do. Just a little odd. Right. Um, they are pretty clean. Just I think I don't even remember when the last game came out. It's like 2013, I think. 2012, 2013. And these, I'm sure you can see that these are DNA desktop. You can see by the soles. Nah, they're clean. Just I can't do oh, that. Oh, you're not gonna be able to post it. You get, get that much for them? Yeah. I came in because I didn't want to wait on them. Um, what can you do for the, uh, the Oreos? What are you asking for those? Um, could you do about somewhere in the high 170s? Something right, like that. Check. But are people really paying like a thousand like for those black hats? Because I looked on Stock yeah. X. People really. Looked on Go. Looked on Kicks. I'm like, no way. People are actually going to pay a thousand dollars for these. When I'm looking, I'm like, but the last time I looked at these, they were like three and some change. That's when the days were simple. Our times were very easy back then. These are 12 and a half. That's my perfect size. What's going on, man? What's going on? That's my cousin right there. Oh, I know. I know. Which ones are these Kobe's called? What is those called? The oh, green the green ones? ones? The green uh, ones? The green shoes. Green shoes. All right, so just so I can understand your rating, what would you yeah. rate these? Out of a 10, what do you rate these? Because I told you my kicks in the house was an 8. What are you rating these? Nah, I'm not. What's your rating first? Uh, you said you wanted three for these? Do that, you know what I'm saying? You know, game has been dropped since 2011, man. So for a while. But what's your rate on those out of a 10? So I understand your scale. Yeah, let me let me see what somebody else will rate. I got mad sneakers. <laughs> let me see, and I don't be random like this. So what would you put this way? If somebody asked you like, out of a 10, what's your scale on these? But, you know, 9 out of 10? Nah, these are not. Okay, so now I understand your scale. So I got mad 8s. I don't really, I don't really I have 8s, eight, 8 and a half in the house. I don't really scale sneakers like that, though. that's the thing, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, these I could hold off on, on the gamers? Yeah, there's three is way too high, I'd just be way too off on those. To sit on those. So what's the max you're going to do? These, and like, supposedly, they're supposed to be coming back out, supposedly. This so, Christmas? I'm not sure, just supposedly, heard they're coming back out, so probably just hold off on those. I could do these, though. What you said? for the Oreo. Uh, you said 170, give me at 150. Maybe at 150, maybe at 160. That's cool. That uh, how did you pay you last time? You, you Apple Pay me. Um, Apple Pay? Uh, Apple Pay is cool. Right, I yeah. do have a question though, I am curious. Yeah. Black Cat 4 is size 10. New? No. I, got, I gotta see them. I gotta see them. How clean are they? I gotta no, clean, they clean them. them. I have to clean them. I'm not gonna lie. Are they clean? <laughs> they're got... very clean. Right now, they're about an 8. I can bring them to a 9. <laughs> I wanna <laughs> say it. <laughs> <laughs> what you here for today? I think those trousers are going to be It's a nice jacket. Thank you, bro. It's a nice hat, too. I'm telling you, all you guys is the finest. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you never see what the bullshit on. You see the pants? Damn. Damn. <laughs> it's definitely a high end uh, Gore Tex type thing. Oh, yeah. There's one by my job. Is it, is it the outlet? No, it's nah. like a. It's like a standalone store, like a nice one. Uh, what are you asking for these two? I'm trying to get close to this guy. Uh -huh. Trying to get the traps. What else do you have? I'm trying to get closer, bro. Okay, some blues. I was hoping that's close. What are you valuing each? I don't know, I, feel, I, think I, I think I'm like in the area right now. Alright, let me ask him first because I know that's his personal pair. Um, so I, yeah, I, yeah, of course. I gotta see what he's gonna value it at because, like I said. I mean, you got it on eBay for 18, so you take 15%, right? Uh, so it's like 180, like 260. He said, what are you valuing your stuff at? Like 14, 15. For these three? Yeah. And would you add cash on top? How much? Because I see you got another shoe. I don't know what shoe that is. Yeah, I was waiting for you. The shoe is there. Pricing of these three. It's not a, it's not oh, a huge it's a, shoe. It's yeah. a GS? Yeah, it's a GS, but it adds a value. I just want to see where you were at with these three first. What were you actually asking like separately, like each? Like what was it what was the breakdown? Uh, I was thinking like almost six for these. Okay. Like three fifty to four. Same with these. How much here? 354? Yeah. I think that. I don't know what they're going for it, but.
but this definitely sounds like we might be off. I wanted to go all four of these evening. That's what I was hoping. Hoping we're close. Um, after speaking with him, we'll probably be at like 1050 for the three shoes. Cause you said six five or six. No, you said six three fifty and three fifty basically, or something like something around there. I just think that these two together are like close to at least nine. You want to say ten fifty? Yeah. Um, it was yeah. It's literally where it was at. It was nine for these two. Yeah, and then one fifty for this one. Yeah. Because we want to sell for like around like two fifty. So how much cash is he asking to add? How much cash would you want to add? You can't give me a number? Because <laughs> <laughs> he said he really wanted 17 trade-wise for the traps. So I would assume like around like the 6, 650 ish range. He'll probably want. How I could do five. How about, how about I, I do five and I'll throw in that, that Ame white, that white Ame 550 I have. That you didn't, that you turned down yesterday. What's that, um, and a half? Yeah. You had the 550s with you? Yeah, it's my phone. All right, let me check them out. You said the 550s plus five, right? Yeah, yeah. Alrighty. So you said he can do that. He'll do the four plus the five. So these shoes plus the five on top. All right. Uh, Zell? Yeah. All right. All right. Fucking Jordan strikes again, bro. <laughs> Yo, don't start that shit. Don't start this shit. <laughs> nah, start. Gotta be again, bro. <laughs> Yo. Uh, nah, that's cap. <laughs> that's so cap. Taking advantage of the little people, bro. <laughs> I'm the smallest one here, man. <laughs> I'm definitely the smallest one. You check both of them out? Um... I'll take a look at the phone. Yeah. But they're both good, right? Yeah. Look at them. Yeah, I know you tried this one yesterday. This is just a rifle. I trusted, bro. No, I don't. Uh, Aaron Top Shelf. I don't want you. As long as you're saying that, I got you again. Like something money to Aaron? <laughs> yeah. What's it for? Jordan got me. <laughs> On the memo, Jordan got me. <laughs> got me again. You want to use your bag or you want a new bag? Nah, I'm cool. I just. That's good. I got mad bags here. These are yours. I mean, you can leave those two if you want. How much can we finish? <laughs> uh, nah, he was, he was just going to pass them down. We had a tray go down. Shout out to our guy, Shinami. Man, always coming by and trying to get the good stuff. Yesterday he came by. As you guys saw, he traded some stuff in. Talked about the size 11 and a half Travis Scott fragment. It was A size. You know, it sold on eBay, but the guy never paid. So, you know, he just happened to come by and he asked us about the size and he was interested about them. So, yeah, man, really happy about this um, this deal that just went down. So, we're going to start off here. I hate buying this shoe. Probably one of the harder. Slap from the Air Force is one of the harder Travis Jordans to move for us. You know, market just dipped on these. These are not hitting like they used to hit. So these are a little bit low right now on the market, but it's easier to sell multiple shoes than it is to sell one big lump sum of a shoe that goes for that much. So we got these in the trade, a good size, 11 and a half sale off by five. Right now, I believe we have like a 13 up on eBay. So it's good to get a size like this. I feel like this shoe is probably gonna move pretty fast. AOD 550, it's one of the newer pairs, just white, gray, a little fuzzy material right here comes with two laces gray and cream so not much to say about this shoe this was like a throwing shoe the last one you can put this on the shelf probably actually put that up there size 11 and a half storm blue so everything in here is 11 and a half so if you guys see anything you like it's going to be up on the ebay you guys know how this goes if you see something to ebay call us dm us let us know you're interested in the shoe burns over there having trouble take a picture for goat struggling it's not focusing it's a quarter of seven, uh, wrapping up here. Not much to say, really. Busier day than yesterday, but getting a lot of Yeezys up online. A lot of stuff in the warehouse getting brought over. Shout out to everyone who stopped by, spent money with us, traded with us. Shout out to everyone who bought something online or traded online. January 28th, we'll be at Got So, so pull up on us, sell some stuff. We'll have stickers, most likely, stuff like that. Gonna have a table, so yeah, pull up on us and have a good show. Um, that's about it, though. It's your one and done. Shout out to everyone who shopped today, came to the store, one and done. Bye. Bye. Bye.
YouTube, what is good? We are back, and it's Thursday, and it's raining, but it's okay. We have a bunch of orders here. Again, guys, shout out to everyone who orders hoodies and stuff like that. Remember, they are brand new, and remember, we do vacuum the floor every day. A lot of you guys understand that. A lot of you guys don't. It is what it is. Shout out to everyone for ordering hoodies. I know we got one going to Ronald, one going to Omar, and one going to, what's a, what's it? Nick. Oh, Primetime Nick. If you know, you know. In Florida, <laughs> shout out to you. Appreciate the support as always. Boom. Got some used ugly dunks, I guess you could call these. I don't really know what's going on. These are the undercovers. Hey, Oz. Don't even ask what that, I mean, I don't even know. I'm not even going to go there. I know you guys are going to drop in the comments exactly what that shoe is, so appreciate you for doing that. Speaking about exactly what that shoe is, man, this is a beautiful sneaker right here. The Griffey Volt Royal Blue. Very nice pair right there. Red 11 Lowe's. We got the Volt Air Jordan 1. Guys, my investment in Vice on this sneaker back when it came out, probably terrible. I probably thought this sneaker was going to go up. I mean, boom, cut it right there. What, what does it look like, Berwin? <laughs> Black toe. Black toe. Kind of. Yeah. You know, you got to cut this though, because that's just terrible. But yeah. I mean, come on. <laughs> cut it. Boom. Black toe. Didn't work out. These really don't go for anything. Jordan never should have dropped these. Personally, I think these are one of, if not the most terrible sneaker of all time. Definitely Jordan 1, maybe, but I don't know. Union 2s. These aren't doing well, but if you like them, it's awesome because you can pick up a used pair for like 100 to 150, a new pair for 150 to 200. These mochas are going out. Shouts to the dude who ordered these. I think he watches the content. So, what's his name? Mocha 3. Paul. Paul, shouts to you, Paul. We greatly appreciate it. We got some lightly used foam runners. We got some brand new Desert Sages and some brand new Beluga Reflectives. Evan was going through a lot of Yeezys yesterday, so hopefully we're going to hit a lot of them to the website as well as drop prices, get stuff out. Anything for the people, guys? You said a lot of Yeezys. Why they hit the eBay right now? A lot of different sizes. A lot of bigger sizes, too, which is actually good. Like a couple Dazzling, a little Oreos, you know, a little Desert Sage. A little bit of that. I think Burr and I was talking about it the other day when we got them in. The, um, the Union 2s. So they're a really cool sneaker and they're really cheap right now so it's definitely a sneaker if you really want it you could definitely get it for like you said like around 120 150 use probably like 170 new i'm really happy about that buy too because we already sold two sneakers from that buyout already in the same day the beautiful mocha threes just like really clean really pristine the bread 11 lows that you don't see all the time those vault ones i remember we were buying those that was the same time we were buying metallic golds it looked good in the moment it really did i remember we sold a couple and it was like damn like it's trending upwards and you know face playing a little bit on that buy but again, can't win every every buy, every investment. So it happens. The beautiful Griffies. I wish they would bring back the black pair. Because I think the black pair is the best pair out of the Griffies, in my opinion. And then I'm going to shout out three people for the t-shirt. Like A said, uh, Roland, Omar, and Primetime Nick. Shout out to you guys. And we'll put some stickers in there. His name's Roland? Roland, Ronald. Oh, my bad. But shout out to you guys. Another hoodie we're missing that we're going to get soon. But if you guys don't have a hoodie, get a hoodie. I kind of wear mine almost every day. I did wash mine already, so before you guys say something, I did wash it. Get your hoodie. Yeah, there's a couple of good shoes in here. Those Mocha 3s, those Bread Lows, those Griffies. Griffy was like a man back in the day. He was also super swaggy, which I really liked about him. Shout out to the people who've been buying the Yeezys. We have a ton of them, like everyone said. If you see the color you want, cop it. Shout out to the person who bought the Mochas. Those are absolutely beautiful. And those Union 2s, really cool. I was high on them at first, but... But a little iffy on them now. Still really cool. Um, we got them out because we just got them uh, recently. So, shout out to you. I don't know how much talking you're going to get out of me today. So, let's just talk about some stuff real quick. Like Jordan said, obviously not every investment is a good investment. Sometimes we make investments in these sneakers and we think they're going to go to the moon. And a lot of them don't. And that kind of just goes to show you that making money is very difficult. Running a business is difficult. Making investments is difficult. People out there that think this stuff is easy where we're just going to, you know, buy a sneaker. Or you're going to you put money into the stock market or Bitcoin or whatever. And then a year or two, you're just going to like be rich or that sneaker is going to be worth a ton of money. Yeah, sometimes it might work like that. You might get super lucky, but a lot of the times, a lot of trial and error, a lot of losses, a lot of L's, a lot of bad investments. But a lot of that stuff kind of motivates you to try to make a better one or just to learn your lesson for the next round, right? I kind of don't really want to super invest into sneakers after what I've been through the past couple years. I made some good investments, yeah, but lately the way the market looks like, I don't know. I'd rather just buy sneakers I want to personally wear, you know, buy stuff that's selling good for the store, but not try to like see the future and say, oh, these Volt Jordan 1s are going to be the next big thing and they're going to be going for 500 bucks and blah blah blah. I've tried that so many times and uh, I failed so many times. You just got to kind of hustle every day, at least in my opinion. Hustle every day, try to, you know, make quick flips, make profit. You can't be mad at yourself for making a uh, small profit if it's a profit. Stop worrying about like what a sneaker or what a shoe or what a car or what a house or what anything's going to be worth in like three years and just kind of like living today. But uh, yeah, just good memories buying fat shit that uh, doesn't go up in value. I love Berwin's outfit today. He looks like a snowboarder from the <laughs> from the video game SS Tricky. Yes. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, but I, no, seriously, that's fire. Speaking of fire games, 1080 snowboarding was fire. I forgot yes. who I was talking to about that the other day who said he didn't play it for N64. I think that was the first snowboarding yeah. game I remember. And uh, they also had a Tommy Hilfiger sponsorship in the game oh, wow. where they had like the Tommy boards and they had like the billboards with Tommy. And uh, with that being said, soon I probably got to get, now I, now I probably got to get 1080 so we can like put yeah. it in there and, and let it just run. The 1080 was really awesome. Shout out to everyone for watching the content. You know, Berwin and I have been hustling, really trying to put out videos. I commend him for what he's been doing, making sure, you know, the videos are on time. We've even been putting out like two or three a week. I've really been trying hard to get on top of the videos. I know I was behind on content. I stopped filming content. I was down on the content. And uh, now I'm kind of like getting more ahead of the game. And uh, when we go to Got Soul, it's definitely going to be awesome to get another one or two sneaker show videos in because I'm excited. I'm going to bring a lot of bread. We're going to spend a lot of money. Hopefully if we can find some good deals. And yeah, I'm just super excited. So let's pack up all this stuff and see what happens. Today. Yeah, if you need a mirror, I can get you a mirror too. I can get you a full body one. This is the white. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, I know these kind of run a little smaller too. Like, uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Let me use like between Maybe when I come back for the other job. Okay. Okay. I can fucking snatch that up on you. Uh, if I do like 10 each on the beanies. Mm. And the jacket. I like 30 on the jacket, 10 on the bro. Appreciate it. So yeah. like uh, I actually caught something from the, from yeah. his brand. Uh, the other yeah, one, yeah. 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 the first one. Yeah. The, I think it's the nine. I caught that jacket. Oh, yeah. Got and then I'll, I'll, I'll come yeah, snap it up. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah, he I, makes I, some, some pretty I, clean uh, stuff. Um, I even have the black one, the black and white, and the white one. You got me a, this is nice. Uh, I like the parkers. I'll pick up the tailgate. You want the number? Yeah, look on the inside. I know, it's nice and warm. Exactly. Oh, you need back? Uh, yeah, well, I think I'm going to have a problem Oh, eight, one, two. Yeah, All right, guys, I'm here with my boy Chevy. I mean, he's been doing this a very long time, but recently, are, is this full on? This is this what you're only doing right now? Full on. Uh, full on. He, he kind of drive, UPS driver. jumped off the entrepreneur cliff. <laughs> and as you can see, we got the rhythm and ribs smokehouse. Guys, the food is delicious. Whatever you guys like, you need to pull up on this man. Where are you recently at? Newark, uh, usually? Yeah, I'm usually at uh, 538 Broad Street, especially uh, on Fridays. Uh, that's Newark Local Beer. It's a new brewery. Come through and get some briskets and some beer, you know? Come through, the food is good. Briskets and beer sounds really good to me. You can obviously follow him on, Inst you're on Instagram, right? Yeah, Instagram. Rhythm and Ribs. You see the logo, pull up on him if you want some good food. He al you also do events, of course. Yeah, do events, block parties, so as wedding. you can see, he pulled up. We all know I'm not really a Giants fan, so but he's still my guy over here, you know what I mean? He pulled up to get some more Giants merch. Rain, sleet, snow, shine, he's, he's out here cooking it up, so yes. I wanted to shout him out. We always like entrepreneurs over here, so if you haven't, check him out and uh, grab some good eats. Check it out. Everything is cooked with wood too. Oh yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got wood, you know. If you ever want to hire me, you see what's going on. I got lights, I got speakers. You so see when what's you, going on. When you hire me, this trailer is yours. You know what I'm saying? So come through. Pull up, one stop some, shop. He'll pull up, party, all that. You everything. Know what I'm saying? He'll bring some the lights, the DJ. Smoke barbecue. He'll bring some sneakers with him too. He'll yeah. All that. Let's do it, baby. <laughs> so, <laughs> I appreciate you. Yeah, anytime, bro. See always, you soon, man. man. You always got the good merch. Uh huh. Make oh, sure yeah. you check out the store. You always got anything you need. Check out the eBay store. A buck, buck fifty, a buck, buck fifty two, two twenty. Yeah. And I don't know if these. He's not really sure if he wants to sell. Okay. Which one? The. These. Okay. These. Do you want to sell? All right, I will. All right, here. First question. Oh, I already know what you're gonna say. Nah, not for sale. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> these were my favorite. Hey. Oh man, how'd y'all get these? Um, my boss probably bought them or found them at a flea market or whatever. Say what is it again? My boss either bought them or found them at a flea market. Okay, so those I'll hold off on. The, um, the E6. Uh, the other stuff, I was at 375 So it was 100 125 150 Because these these two are, some will go around the same. And these are like two mil. Um, two, 220 so that's 375. And then that one I'll just hold off on because it's still sitting on like websites. I think uh was the A6 website. It's still, mm -hmm. it's still there. So okay. you think you do four? Uh I will flip a coin, but I feel like you beat me last time. So I don't want to do that. <laughs> you could win the time. Yeah, I thought I did a coin flip a one. I'm trying to, trying to end it on that note. <laughs> 
So you're not doing no coin flip for the rest of the year? Not at the end of the year of last year with the coin flip. So you might as well start. You're never gonna do it all this year then? When I with a bang. That's crazy. My first coin flip was a W. My last one gonna be a W. What is he asking for these? He's asking for four. Four? Yeah. And then you don't want to sell the, um, the yellow toes? Um, you said you were going to wear them. I don't know you talked to him after that. Mm -hmm. Call him and find out if you want to try and sell the yellow toes. He's on a roll. I don't really want to call him to try them. He wants four for these? Yeah, he wants four. Yeah, uh, hold on. You Yo, oh, you still trying to sell the yellow toes or no? What you doing on that? What's he asking? He want to know what you're asking. At least box, right? Yeah, box. I'll probably just pass. You see, if he wants box, they're going for box. I'll just hold off on him. I'll be under box. Yeah, he'd be under box. What the best you would do, like if it, if it, if it's under box, what the best? Probably like one fifty. One fifty. You mean four should four shouldn't be a problem here. What would your best be? What are you thinking? For these? Yeah. I said it wouldn't be a problem. Like I, I would run the four. If that's what you, you said. You'd run four. Well, how are you doing? Like that? So you go to you. Hmm? You do. You got an Apple Pay, Venmo, PayPal, all that stuff. Or I can send it all to you. Then I gotta give it to them. I'm, I'm just saying. Like, I ain't doing all that. That's that, that, that bad deal. Uh, all right. So you asked me how is the money being received? Yeah, yeah that's I'm, what I'm asking. Cause yeah, usually I would just send it to AJ, but he said he don't want to do all that. He just want to collect his bread. I'm not to send it to you, or then I'm not to send it to Owen. I guess you can Apple Pay me. Yeah. Alright, I'll turn it on. I wish I had any vintage stamp like that. Oh, actually, yeah, I forgot I have these here. Yo, you want them? What's that? Those I feel like you would rock them. My fault, like you got it. Yeah, I don't know what you want. Yeah, I don't know what you want. It's free, you might as well take it. <laughs> <laughs> sure. That is facts. Even if you won't use them, you can use it for a tray, you know what I mean? Yeah. I put them on like once, but then I end up dirty, and I think this one's the one that's dirty. Yes, yeah, this yeah. one. What are, you, what are you asking for this stuff? Look, I'm gonna be honest with you, for the dunks, I was hoping at least to get 80 for each, but I don't know if that's too much. Mm -hmm. I know the boxes beat on this one. Mm, we'll see. And for the this one, I'm not sure. You can throw me a price. So the toxins. Yeah, man. <laughs> I've been doing like I've been like doing like a lot of searching online lately. Anyway, see if I can find something through the cracks. You said you want 80 here. You didn't know what you want here. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I have a price. I was at two here. I was at 50 here. These two I would pass just because of the sizing. And this one doesn't go for anything. Um, you, this this uh, one. I'll be cool with two. Okay. You want to do 50 for each? This one goes for like a hundred. That's the problem. So I'll have to hold on. And the size of this one, because it's a seven. If it was a seven and a half, I would have taken it. But yeah, it's a seven mints. Because it's a seven, that's more so like the gray school women um, sizing. You don't want your pass on it? I mean, yeah. if even if not even for 50, just so I can get rid of them. I'll take this one back. It's no big deal. I'll put it on this This one, we just have so, these just don't move for us. Like even the, the bigger sizes, they don't move. I'll double look. Double check, just in case. You never know. Yeah, it's like 120. This one's probably going for much higher. I'll probably hold off on this one. These two, I know we could probably move. That's cool. Real fast. Um, you said two, right? Yeah, two and 250. I mean, two and 50. Yeah, right yeah I know what you meant. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that's cool. Fuck it. Uh, I took a wear out of them and I got them for retail, anyways. What's the best way? Uh, Yo, yeah, cash. If no not, cash. you can do sell. No. Okay. What's the best Everything? Yes. Okay, where are you looking for everything? 
Now let's go with my wing first. Let's see. Um, so off the bat, these four I'll probably hold off on just due to condition and stuff like that. Um, these three I may be interested in. Like, where are you looking for these? Can you give me a number? Throw me a number. Uh, I'm not sure what they're going for, like, off the top of my head. I just want to see where you're at. I think this is a Uh, this is the University Gold. That's what you want for these? 180? And what about this one? That is special edition too. I say like two. Two? Most definitely. And what about these? What was those? Let me see. Uh, this, like, black ones. Nah, this was the chocolate. Oh, the chocolate. One fifty. One fifty. One fifty. One fifty. Yeah. One fifty good. If I know this good. This gonna be. This gonna be a kick, kicker right here. He don't want, I was gonna pass on those. You yeah. passing on them too? Yeah, he's mm -hmm. gonna hold off on the condition. Yeah. So, so he said uh, 180, 140, 150. No, two. Oh, you want two? Oh, yeah, I'll probably pass on this stuff, honestly. I think. All of them? Yeah, I, well, this stuff is just the condition I'll pass on. The condition of these are kind of like similar, a little bit better, but I'll probably just pass on it too because I can't pay uh, like 180 to. And 150. These are going for like two new. I'll be way less on all three, honestly. I won't be nowhere near what you're asking for. I'll say shopping around other spots, see what they say. But I can't come nowhere close to what you're asking for. And you can throw a number. You ain't throw one yet. So yeah. even even 150 is. <laughs> what was your I mean, number? They, they brand new too. Give me a number. You don't want to hear my number. I'm I'll be, listening. I'll be low. I'm listening. You want to hear my number? I I'll be at like like 120 for all three. Okay, we can, you know, 124 all three. Huh? 124 all three. I mean, it kind of dog. <laughs> you try other spots already? No, like I said, this is, you know. I'll say what's on this. First time. Um, I don't know where you guys are from, but there's another store down the Ave. You can try one of those two. I think they close at seven. You can see what they say, see what they offer you. Probably offer you more. Probably get all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, where you say that other spot was at? How far it is? 10, 15. You literally just go all the way down to Montclair. It's on Bluefield Ave. You know where, uh... No, I'm not from over here. Uh, where you guys from? But we from Jersey. There's no problem. Oh, I was just going. All right. That's cool, then. Why? <laughs> I can't remember what kind of thing I can buy. Because it's like, you can, be, you can be like from a lot of places. I like, mean, there's, there's sneaker stores everywhere. So like, I'm not trying to point you in a spot that's not close to you guys. That's what I'm saying. Like, oh. I'm trying to point you in another direction. I mean, we're right here. That's what I was saying. The one that you were speaking about. That's close It's that like 15 minutes, 10, 15 minutes. Just straight mm -hmm. down the app that way. You said Montclair app, correct? Uh, Bloomfield app. Bloomfield off of Montclair. Oh, Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. All right. Have a good night, You too. It is 6.33. We are wrapping up here today. Today was quite eventful, I must say. Overall, today was a good day. Got a lot of work done. A lot of Yeezys are officially hidden down the eBay. I know we talk about that. We don't really buy Yeezys like that. We try not to. Um, this is just Yeezys that we've had in our warehouse. That's just been sitting for quite some time now. So, you know, just money sitting in the warehouse. So we, we decided to get it up. A lot of sizes, a lot of different things. 350, 700, Quantum, from Runner, Slides. Like a lot of stuff in different sizes. So, God so we will be there next week, January 28th. The Saturday we will be close so you know give you guys a little time in advance do not pull up because we won't be here so yeah that's about it for me burn with anything for the people not much just hope you guys are enjoying the daily uploads like I said earlier today we have been going back to back with uh videos and stuff like that pushing the content out there so I'm glad that you guys are enjoying the content and hopefully you guys continue to enjoy the content we have in the future so shout out to everyone watching one and done has anyone made it this year yet no damn can I be the first you can be well, I know. Mm, I don't think so. But one and done. Catch you guys next week. Oh.